what's good youtube man um so this is just a brief insert i'm finna get into the we finna get into the video but after when i was editing it and after i reviewed the video a little bit it doesn't tell the full picture that i wanted to tell but i need to get content out to you guys so um i, I just wanted to do this insert to kind of explain what the video is um to a certain extent if you can tell by the title it's about um how i use ai to be productive um as a cybersecurity analyst um and also as a grad student um, i'm in school for to get my master's as well so um in this video i would just give you some slight tips and tricks on where i insert ai into my career um and also how i use it to leverage its capabilities with my job you know um and this just came about just from a lot of like tech pages and outlets are saying like ai is taking people jobs but you know i think that might be true a tad bit but ai is really helping people with their jobs as well so yes it is taking some jobs and i explained this a little bit um in the video but it's also helping people with their jobs it's helping stuff to become better as well so uh we just as a society just have to find a way to balance it all out and you know that's something that we'll have to work through but i just wanted to get on here just to explain a little bit of what this video is about just get a little more context hopefully this done this did that for you uh gave it a little more context but i ain't gonna hold you up no more i'm about to go upstairs and get in the pool and chill um hopefully you enjoy this video Y'all to blame for what we could have been, cause look at what we are Your friends are scared to tell you you went too far Funny that it's always been all about you from the start I met someone who last night and we kicked it And I'm going back there tonight You know what's on my mind this time what's good youtube man welcome back to another video uh thank you for clicking on this video if you haven't already please subscribe because i know you don't like the video and please hit that thumbs up button to push it out through the algorithm um but in this video as you can tell from the title this is a productive day in my life um video as a cybersecurity analyst um using eight using ai the things that i use ai for and how it helps me in my day-to-day -day job and also how it helps me in content creation and personal life so uh, yeah hit that thumbs up button we're gonna get right into it and i'm gonna show y'all how i use ai in my daily life first thing in the morning i start off by checking my email with Apple Intelligence. Apple Intelligence helped me check my email faster, so I don't have to keep scrolling through my email. Apple Intelligence automatically put what's important right in front of me, right up top, so I don't have to um, scroll down and, and look through multiple emails or when I start my day. So it's super helpful when I'm busy and it helps me um, reply quicker uh, with suggested replies. So it's super smooth and this is how I start my day. One thing when I do my desk, uh, the first things I do in the morning is check my email and reply to emails uh, because I get a lot of them uh, throughout the day. And then I also uh, make sure that um, I haven't missed any Teams message. Uh, one thing that helps me with this 
at least my secret weapon is ChatGPT. Um, I I do use ChatGPT for like grammar checks. So when I'm typing up an email, I might put um in ChatGPT to help me with grammar or um understand something that I don't understand. Um, so yeah, it's a big help when doing repetitive tasks. So um, so that's why I use ChatGPT in my workspace is to um use it when I'm doing tasks that um are constantly being repeated. And when you look into like the job market now, I think that's where AI is, I wanna say taking jobs, but that's where AI, AI is filling the gap in, is if your job does a repetitive task, um, AI can take a large part of that workload on itself because it's good at doing stuff over and over and over and over again because um it learns from it and it is going to do it in a more detailed fashion the same way every time so um yeah that's why i use uh ai in my work um life but let me get to these emails and i can back up with y'all later so i'm going to get ready for a meeting uh one thing that uh, I do use faithfully um, is summarizing my notes, my uh, meeting notes, especially if I'm the one leading the meeting. But uh, right now, I'm not um, in this meeting. I'm not going to be the one leading the meeting, but um, I will be taking notes. And, you know, when people talk fast and you try to jot down notes, you get a lot of typos. You, you have a lot of things that doesn't. It's not clear if you go back and read it later after the meeting is not fresh off your brain. Um, ChatGPT do a great job of summarizing your notes, putting it in a form where it's understandable and you won't have just gibberish. And like, what, what does this mean? So um, that's one thing that I use. Uh, that's another thing that I use AI for. Um, is my meeting notes and summarizing my notes after a meeting and it's great for when you're leading a meeting too and you're just trying to jot stuff down quick uh while you're leading the meeting if your teammate can't do it so uh that's another thing so i'm about to uh get into this meeting and uh finish off my day um and then i have school work to do later on and probably get some dinner and stuff so but let's get into this meeting YouTube, um, I did finish uh, my email, all that stuff. I did start on um, mapping uh, some controls to risk. Um, that's what I'm working on today, uh, mainly. That's going to take some time because it's a lot of controls and risks to you know, work through and stuff. But I am using AI to help me with that, uh, especially help me with getting the the controls and seeing what best maps with each other so um that's what i'm completing now uh, for the day but it's lunch time about to go get something to eat and uh yeah uh, i think i'm gonna just um grab something quick uh probably some chips or something go upstairs enjoy uh the rooftop because the, the the weather is super nice outside so let's get it let's go do that and then uh, we'll finish up the day and also have some schoolwork to do. So we'll do that tonight as well. So let's go.
one thing I say uh, so much on my channel that I am in school. Um, I am in school to get my master's degree in cloud computing and enterprise networks. So using ChatGPT in school has saved my life. I wish I had it around when I was doing my bachelor's from writing a paper and then making sure uh, ChatGPT can put it in um, APA uh, style format for me. Uh, from making sure that all my references are are there, making sure that uh, I, I do a lot of flow charts and diagrams while working in networking, uh, well, get my degree in networking. I mean, um, I do a lot of flow charts and diagrams. So ChatGPT is amazing with me typing out what I want to see, explicitly details, and then ChatGPT give me a visual on how to create that diagram. Um, I don't. I like, I actually enjoy making a diagram myself. So if I can get ChatGPT to this, tell me how the best way for it to logically flow. And I can, it does a great job of segmenting it uh, for me too, for security purposes and all that stuff. So um, I use ChatGPT Chat for that. Uh, but needless to say, I'm about to do some homework. So that's going to end off this video. Uh, make sure you hit that thumbs up button, like, comment, and subscribe, man. We're on the road to 14K. Um, I appreciate you guys for watching this video. Hopefully, um, you liked it. If you did, make sure you comment down below. Um, but, I'm out. Peace.